thingy. But if you ask for Bosnian coffee, you'll get this with a smile. <laughs> now, what's the major difference is Bosnian coffee is ground and roasted, pre-roasted. That's a special technique. I know all about it. Then you put only the coffee in the jezva and roast it for a few seconds, seven, eight seconds, just to get a bit of a smell. Then you would pour hot water to the, ha to ha to the half of the jezva, let it foam up once on the fire, let it cool down once. Let it foam up a second time, let it cool down a second time. Let it foam up a third time, let it cool down a third time, and then pour more hot water over it. Over it. Now, that's the jezva. The filjan is your drinking cup. It's got no handle, so it takes a bit of using, getting used to. And this is a shechet look where you keep the sugar. Now, sugar is consumed like in sugar cubes, not like crystal sugar. Why is that? Well, we don't use filters in our coffee. So what you get is a coffee with a whole lot of sludge down. <laughs> and it takes a few minutes for that sludge to, to you know, to rest on, on the bottom. And you, if you would like put crystal sugar in it, you'd have to, you know, like mix, stir it up, and then you would have all that sludge in your mouth. So what you do is you take a cube of sugar, you dip one edge of it into the coffee, you bite a little bit of it off, put it under your tongue, and drink coffee over it. The real, the real art is to drink a whole filjan with only one cube of, or of sugar. Usually people take like three or four because they don't know how to drink, you know, it's like... <laughs> okay, I drink mine without sugar, I never learned it, I gotta be honest. <laughs> so this is like the Bosnian item, you know, it's like that's the most representative thing in Bosnia is like coffee culture. In some, in some places here in the Bashtash you'll even get a Turkish delight and a single cigarette to your coffee for like one and a half marks. So it's like really, really traditional. I should have make for a photo. <laughs> okay, now you may have noticed that we've got a few weird things lying around here, right? Anybody knows what this is? I'll give you a tip. Artillery canister. There's a 75 millimeter artillery shell. It was shot on Sarajevo during the siege. Why is it here? 